better, and that's, that's on me to get them in the right positions at the right time and make sure they can understand what's going on and, and play better. Uh, we have a good team, and like I say, they're a good team, so we just didn't play well enough today and do what we need to do. Well, you you think, coach, can you hold that microphone for AC? What's your first thoughts about the way Kellen's performance? I thought he started off. He had a couple throws early that he, you know, couldn't get in the group, and then we drop one off the bat, and then we miss one, and you know, just a hair high here, here, and then then he started getting in the group, and then we got some protection, and you know, he kept battling and playing well. But I didn't think he was in sync early. We just just a hair off, or when he was in sync, we were dropping the ball. Or as an offense, we were out of sync. You know what I'm saying? And he, you know, and he kept battling, and played hard. Did you think the defense played well enough to win today? Listen, we didn't win, so there ain't no offense, defense. One side wins good enough. Texas A&M didn't play well enough to win the game. So no, none of us did. And uh, as a team, you do whatever you have to do. But I think I didn't. I thought we played really well at times on defense. I thought they played hard. I we played physical. Uh, gave, gave up some big plays at the wrong time and a big drive. Uh, and some things, but I thought they had their moments. Offense had a few moments, and you know, we got to play better as a team. For crafts, a problem for you. Yeah. Oh, man, a lot of adjustments. We got our blocking scheme. We moved the ball for over 200 yards in the second half defensively, uh, held them to one touchdown. And uh, like I say, we in the other plays that they made, we got a guy come out of coverage on a scramble. If he stays back, we don't know if we make it, but that's what good players do. Their players make good plays when they have to make them. I we made a lot of adjustments on how we can scheme it, how we can block it, how we can move it, and we, then we got down and we just had to finish the drives. Do you think the penalty on Matt of BK there was it just at the end of the half as a big player? It, it's a critical play. Score? No, well, I mean, you don't know. You're, you're long distance right there, and that's a critical play that keeps the momentum. That's what I say. It's just that even if you make a couple of those catches on offense, like they, that play there, it gives you momentum on the other side, and then the next play, it spirals and it keeps going. That's how drives start. In this game of college football in any sport, momentum is huge. And when you keep moving the ball, you have momentum, and good things happen. And they have more momentum plays and did a really good job. How much would it have helped the running game going? Oh, it would have helped big time. But they had an extra guy spying down the box, and we missed a couple blocks. And, uh, you know, we need to get it going. You talk a lot about having SEC depth. You had to sub a lot of guys in on 